We received an urgent message while you were away. It was Inquisitor Goslar. Again. You don't sound delighted, Captain. Not that I blame you. Open the channel. Inquisitor, since your investigation has ended, you may serve the Imperium in more direct ways. The Holy Orders of the Inquisition need you in the Nereus system, urgently. As of today, we have lost contact with the Tempestus Citadel, the main stronghold of the Caligari Conclave. This is a heavily fortified star fort, protected by Imperial battleships and other more exotic measures. This communication blackout is highly unusual. We suspect sinister reasons. For this reason, I strongly recommend that you travel to the Nereus system and offer assistance to the Tempestus Citadel. Should you experience any hostile activity, deal with it with extreme resolve. The Emperor protects. Thanks, 
to the Emperor, you made it! There is no time to lose. The Data Vault is just a stone's throw away. A stone's throw? It does not compute. Never mind, Tech Priest. Lead the way, Archivist. Don't interfere, just stay alive. Might be compromised. You have served your purpose. I will deal with this traitorous scum personally. The Emperor may be with you, Inquisitor. Another lackey for the false Emperor. Your so called Holy Order is weak and negligent. Now prepare to die. I'm always ready for the final sacrifice, traitor. But this is not my day to die. It's yours. before the full-scale invasion. You should return to the ship immediately. For the Emperor! <laughs>
I have a pleasant surprise for you, Inquisitor. You took your time, Inquisitor, but saving the Archive from the Black Legion intruders was a valuable contribution to our cause. Still, our work isn't over yet. While we were cleaning up the mess on the Tempesta Citadel, the whole Nereus system was hit by a full-scale invasion by the Black Legion. You will not leave until the presence of Chaos has been eradicated and their unholy influence has been cauterized. The Emperor protects. The whole system is under attack, but according to the intercepted Vox messages, Nereus III and Nereus IV have taken the hardest hits. Where do we start, Inquisitor? Just mark me the bloodiest hell holes on the star map, Captain. We are going to war. about our situation. It's not great, Inquisitor. The air is full of desperate Fox transmissions. The initial attack of the Black Legion came without warning. They have overrun the local headquarters of the Astra Militarum. Any news about High Marshal Corte? His command post is in the city. Right now, he is our best chance of revitalizing the defenses. According to the latest reports, he was captured with his retinue. A leader unable to defend himself isn't worth following. Parish built! surrender of all remaining Imperial forces, including the Astra Militarum regiments, planetary defense forces, and the local militia. Further resistance would be a futile waste of Imperial lives. Understood. Kill the heretic!
it's time to silence the cowardly propaganda once and for all. Kill the heretic! down there, Inquisitor. Our work in this Emperor-forsaken city is done. The Vox Station is silenced, and the Black Legion traitors are decimated. We'll leave the rest for the Loyalist forces. Hi, Marshal Corte. Explain yourself. What? Where am I? Cursed sorcery! Inquisitor, I wasn't myself! I swear by the Emperor I could never betray our cause! A smart decision, Inquisitor. The gratitude of a High Marshal is a strong currency. the defenses personally. The battle here looks like a sideshow. I humbly disagree, Inquisitor. This is an isolated backwater world with a single functional void port. Losing the only connection to the Imperium would be a logistical nightmare, not to mention the psychological impact. You must silence the Black Legion artillery before the void shields fail. And the thriving rogue trader enclave in this besieged void. What can I say, Inquisitor? We are who we are.
good start, but time is running out. Affirmative. The void shields protecting the void port are working at 32% efficiency, detecting increasing fluctuation in the dispersion patterns. friends will be grateful, Captain. They aren't our friends, Inquisitor. They are the ones who owe us a favor.
thriving capital. Now there is nothing left but ashes. That's not entirely true. The majority of the local population is deceased or missing, but the bioscanners have located a large group of survivors. Their numbers are dwindling, though, following a perfectly regulated pattern. Strange. It makes sense, Magos. I have analyzed the operations of the traitors, and their attack against the Nereus Three is an odd one. It's a backwater feudalistic planet, lacking any military, logistical, or economic importance. From their perverted point of view, there is only one important resource here. Exactly. For their unholy rituals. You should rip them apart before it's too late, Inquisitor. This time, your bloodthirst is perfectly appropriate for For the Emperor! Inquisitor. According to the census, this force field is powered by unknown but immense energies. Actually, these readings are fascinating. If only I could try some experiments. That's not why I'm here, Magos. This barrier was created by unholy sorcery. I will find the source and destroy it. Finishing up with this rabble, I detected strange fluctuations in the energy field protecting the Black Legion ritual. Be more specific, Megos. It's only a theory, but it looks like their motive force fuels the energy field. All you have to do is sever this bond, and you can disrupt their ritual. I will sever all of their bonds with great severity. Recoil unclean! of inspection. Clean. 
Burn! Good news, Inquisitor. The energy field has collapsed. You can now access the site of their rituals. Good news indeed. They will pay the price for butchering this city. Inquisitor. Just in time. The ritual was almost complete. Had they opened the warp rift, this planet would have been engulfed by demonic hordes. Alas, there is not much left to save or reclaim here. Time to return to the ship. I have an urgent message for you, Inquisitor. Inquisitor, the flagship of the Black Legion, the Inferius Eternum, has finally revealed itself at Nereus IV and started a massive planetary bombardment. The civilian losses are regretful, but this move reeks of desperation. The bombardment resulted in massive firestorms and the damage is massive, even for my taste. The Inferius Eternum is still in orbit, led by a heretic Astartes called Lord Antaros, the bringer of damnation. A Calidus assassin managed to infiltrate the ship, but she has failed to properly execute her mission. However, she managed to install a teleport beacon close to the bridge before her regrettable demise. I want you to be the wrath of the Imperium.
mission completed. But this is definitely not the bridge of the Inferius Eternum. Tech Priest, what happened? Unforeseeable foreseeable anomalies in Quintal. The Teleportarium uses short burst warp infusion, and there was interference. Looks like I need to find a way to this warp Correct. Addendum. Warp engine activation detected on the target. The mission should be resolved as soon as possible. Entering the Immaterium on a Chaos Vessel is calculated as an extremely undesirable outcome.
calls for vengeance. No place left to hide, monster. Time to return into the warp, but this time without your wretched body. Big words, and little substance, mortal. As usual, you are just as blind as the false emperor. And that's saying something. But don't worry. I will keep you alive for a little while to witness the fruition of the War Master's plan. The objective I have found in this cogitator is alarming. Abaddon, the cursed despoiler himself, was behind the invasion. I'm afraid it is only the beginning of the true horror. We must warn the Caligari Conclave immediately! 